This is Game of Inches. Six teams of anglers across the ice belt compete for five days for a grand prize of $6,000. Eligible species are narrowed down to seven categories of freshwater fish. The total combined length of the seven fish is their final score. Each team records their longest fish in each category. Who will take home the $6,000 at the end of day five? I'm so nervous. Game of inches, baby. Well, day five is upon us in the game of inches. If you haven't been following along, make sure to watch the previous four videos first and everyone else's videos because we are competing in the biggest ice fishing competition in the world. I made that up, I'm not sure about that. But we got six teams across North America, most kind of in Canada, Central, maybe one team in the States. We got seven categories. You got burbot, whitefish, esox, walleye, whitefish, burbot, stock trout. Seven categories, you take your longest fish from each category and that's your total number of inches. The winner, $6,000 US. So yeah, so there's some serious cash on the line. We uh, were off to a strong start and uh, you know, ran into a, a hiccup, my, my snowmobile died. But that's not an excuse. We are still struggling to catch a lake trout. We caught a lake trout yesterday, but not a big one. So right now we're like on day three of trying to catch a big lake trout. So if we don't catch a big lake trout, we're gonna be fishing for lake trout till the end. If we catch a big lake trout, well, then who knows what's gonna happen. But that's where we have our biggest chance to upgrade. We're at Winoga Lodge and we're going ice fishing. Oh, I'm with Josh McFadden. He's making his bed right now. Packing up sleeping bags, getting ready to get out there and catch a big one. Completely dead. We're doing it though. This last day, we made it. Kind of. We, yeah. We're here. We're here. We made it out here. Quite the ride. Um, yeah, I'm gonna go set tip ups. Cisco on the bottom, big lake trout, big burbot. We'll see. Yeah, we're at the same spot, same holes even. I just had such good vibes here. Big fish vibes. Pop in the shack, kind of stay cozy. It's the coldest morning we've had. We're getting the shack up and we're starting to fish because we are one minute behind. Well, day one, we got splake. And we got crappie in pretty quick order. And uh, I was like, this is a pretty good pace. And now we've been, we got white fish on day two, but we've basically spent the last four days laker fishing and we've caught, you know, caught walleyes, caught burbot, caught pike, which has helped our total. But really, lake trout have just been the, you know, the pain in our sides. I don't know, if we, uh, if we can get one now, we're probably gonna switch and try to get a big walleye because we got some room for improvement there. But we're setting tip ups. We got Cisco setting them in like 40, 45 feet of water. I'm feeling good. We're gonna end this with a bang, Josh. Big Laker, big walleye, maybe a big surprise burba too. Oh, I love those surprise bots. How epic would that be to get the big Laker and a big walleye today? Spirits are good. Spirits are good. We did, we did some math on what people have and what we have, and it's possible to overtake first, but it's gonna take, you know, some big bites. Let's do a little recap on day four score. All right, day four score. In last place, Joe Cooper and Dave Winters, 124 and a quarter. Second last place, Jay and Josh McFadden, 166.5. Third last place, Mark Telly and Aaron Weeb, 171. Fourth last place, uh, uh, Third place, Third place, Andrew Walker and Darian Savage, 177.5. Second place, Adam and Sean Conrad, 179.75. First place, Adam Crawford and Clayton Schick, 187.5. Craziness. That's a good gap going into the final day. All these videos are gonna be linked below. Hopefully you guys have been watching the other ones so you can see the other teams catching impressive fish. We've caught some nice fish. We haven't caught any real stompers yet, but that's all right. And there's gonna be no check-in today. We're only gonna find out when you guys find out when watching the video, who actually won. But I can tell you, if we don't beat 187.5, we didn't win. <laughs> yes, sir. Flake, flake, flake. Come on. Ooh, it feels heavy. Yeah? Yeah. Could be an upgrade. A Little bit of weight. Mm. 
Not much. Medium burbot, maybe. A medium burbot for the team. Release tools, so key. Putting up a little more of a fight now. It's gotta be a burbot. Yep. Decent. We're on the board. They are truly dirty burbs. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> They're always full of scuzz. Well, nice. I hooked him when he popped into the hole. Didn't even measure that one. Don't think it was 25 inches. The flag's a flag. Flag's good though. Flags are exciting. Yeah, the flag was nice. Now at least we got a day five fish. Now we got a fish on the board. It's exciting. So two Lakers swam through and you didn't catch one. That was just one. One Laker swam through and you didn't catch him. I missed two yesterday. They both bit? No, just one. So you missed one yesterday. Okay. Yeah, but I mean, hey, the fish swimming by is a missed oh, What's going on here? That's gonna turn into something big. Get ready. Get ready. Whoa, oh, bam! Yep. Ooh, nice. Walleye. Nice. Big old white fish. Big old whitey. I don't think it's acting like a burbot. Hmm. What do we think we got? He's just under the ice. What has happened? This might be an upgrade. It came fish. up so fast. Yeah. Now it's feeling like a better fish. Oh, please do that. Might be a lake trout. I don't know what it's doing. It's kind of acting like a lake trout now. Yeah, it is, yeah. There's bubbles. Oh, okay. now it's thinking lake trout. Yeah, I gotta look at it. It wasn't that big, but how lights? The drag's decent, like. Oh. <laughs> oh, what is happening? Okay, we got a laker. This fish was not like peppery when it wow. bit. And now it's now it's got all the weight. How was that just like a little blob and then just like, don't celebrate yet. Oh. I was just rubbing your back, I wasn't oh, celebrating. Yeah. No. Can I do stuck. it? Here. No, you're good. Yeah, it's a little Laker. Little guy. Just lift slowly. Oh man. Oh man. He's going in reverse. I'm just worried about the jiggins with so much yep. pressure when he gets. There he goes. I got her. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. A little bit of an upgrade. Oh. I'm switch sides here. It's got a little length. On the old chartreuse. Dinner bell? Yeah, that is significantly bigger. That's an upgrade, baby. There you go. That fish had me so nervous. There you go. Man. All right. All right, let's throw it on the board. Is that mouth closed enough? I feel like it is. 29 and a quarter, got it. All right, 29 and a quarter going back. It's a good start. See you, buddy. And that's what they're feeding on right there. Check this out. I think we probably need a bigger laker if we're gonna switch species still. Don't you feel that? See, that's the problem. That lake, freaking laker was close to being what a we wanted. laker. Yeah. But it's not quite enough. We can pretty much just say we're gonna fish here for, you know, uh, it's, it's just a, it is a lot of driving, but it would be fun to end on the big walleye spot. If your sled had a little more hauling power, I would say let's just take one sled to the walleye spot and send it. I mean, it'll pull a bog in on this stuff. Did we surpass anyone now with our upgrade? That gave us uh, seven inches. We could do 180 if we got a, uh, a big old walleye too. We should just, if you're okay with it, we should double up on your sled and take our time and do that. And if we take my toboggan, that'll give us time to- We don't need a shack. We don't need a heater. We don't, like we need the bare essentials. Yeah, yeah, we, we can make it very late. Um, we're gonna give Troy his sled back and we're gonna just double up on Josh's sled. Jay's gonna sit on my lap though. I'm gonna sit with, uh, I'm gonna sit with Josh. We're gonna double up on his little sled and we're gonna unfortunately have to leave cameraman Brandon in the vehicle. We're, I, I wanna end it on walleye. We haven't targeted walleyes. We've caught walleyes, but it's like walleyes, walleyes are the deal. And uh, I wanna end it with a big walleye. Even, even, even if we don't win, it'd be sweet to end it with a big giant yeah, walleye. And that's yeah. where we have a lot of room for expansion right now. Like we get a 30, 30, like 30 to 32 inch Laker. Yeah, I'm not sure if we'll get a 40 inch Laker, but uh, yeah, like who knows? I think we can upgrade the walleye. Yeah, the walleye, we have the most missing inches. We could get eight inches on that bad boy. Crazy things could happen. We could get a 40 inch Laker and a 32 inch walleye. Oh, he bumped it. He bumped it. I was reeling up. I think I hit him with it. Or the oh, noggin. He's on. 
That's a whitey. Look how big those head shakes are. That's a white fish, boy. Whitey. Come on. That's a big white fish. <laughs> like, that might be close to our other one. He's wrapped on himself. Yeah, just give him a little bit. Wow, that's a big white fish. Gentle. <laughs> They're just the hardest fish to catch. Wow, that's a giant. That's a big whitey. Here we go. Hopefully it doesn't do the old whitefish flipperoo. Yeah, beautiful. Just thick. Just thick. Yeah, cool whitefish. Let's let him go. Yeah, I think you can catch. Fun. I think you catch like 30 of those down there. There were so many down there yesterday. That was a nice fish. Yeah. Josh is on fire today. I was on fire yesterday too. No. All days. Man, I'm just such a good whitefish catcher. Good walleye catcher. That was kind of tough with the hole there. Was. Tough for me, tough to watch. What a crazy. Oh, here we go, that's a lake trout. That is a lake trout. I'm telling you what, just look how big those tail kicks are. Yeah. Wow, why did he just drop to the bottom? No, he's gonna lift up and eat me. Oh, Josh, come on. Yep. Oh. What? I thought for sure I was yeah, gonna, my he line did was that. gonna peel. Oh, he's coming back, he's coming back. I wonder if you hit him in the tail or something. No. No, he was ready by you by that point. Yeah, what the heck? Oh man, I was just like, He's still there. like my He's line's still there. in a screen. Yeah, I know, I thought so too when he took off like that. But there's but fish. Yeah, kind of like text That fish stuff. is ripping on the bottom. Chili and lime though is really good. I like that. Oh, look at this, oh, oh. that might be a laker. Oh, oh, wow. He missed it. Wow. Oh, get ready. This is a laker, here we go, here we go. Look at that tail. Oh, he missed it. Now he's coming for you. Oh my goodness. Oh no. It's okay, it's okay. Now you're gonna get him. Yep. Oh, that was unbelievable. Wow. That was unbelievable, Josh. Crazy action. Oh man, that is some cool live scope footage. It's not that big, I don't think, but. Hey, we'll I think it's a laker. Thing. Here it is, it's a pike. No, and he gobbled it. Oh, he put it back. Well, it was around his lip at least. Oh my goodness, of course that was a pike. She gone. I got line in my fingers too. All right, well, that was disappointing. <sighs> the tail was kicking so much, it looked insane. That was such an aggressive fish. Gotta love it. The definition. On the old live scope machine, it's something special. Oh, good action. We've had a bit of everything this morning. Whitefish, pike, lake trout, burbot, Winoga, book a trip. Ooh, what's that on the left? I like that. Oh, is that one fish? That's one long fish. Oh, Dude, look how they're getting scared away. Dude, that's a big fish. Here we go. Here we go, here we go, here we go. That's like a pike, that's a pike. No, don't say that. Oh. Oh. Oh, screw that up. Oh. Game of inches, baby. Game of inches. Yeah, we're inching. Inching up on the competition. Oh, yeah. I didn't see it, but. That's a lake shot run. Big pike. Oh. Could be better. You got him? Nope. I don't. I don't want to put too much pressure on him. Nope. Nope. That's okay. Oh, he. Jeez. Oh, ho, 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 yes. Saw one look at this guy and he's gone. That thing put her in reverse better than yeah. I've ever seen a fish do that. <laughs> reverse usually doesn't work too well on these fish. He's puking up all types of food. Back him up, head up the hole. The old reverse gill. There you go. No, okay, wow, look him. at that bait. Just keep him in the water. Okay, we got this, yep. Yeah. We're not gonna measure this guy. All right, there's another fat Winoga pike. Probably 35 inches. Sweet, game of inches, baby. We've got inches, we got them long. Good, she's gonna splash you. She's gonna splash you. Yes! Sick. I mean, it's a fish. It's an active fish. So if one fish is active, that means they're all gonna be active now. All right, we got a little pack up to do. Then we gotta rearrange things. Head back towards K-Town. We caught, we caught a couple Lakers. It wasn't easy, but we caught a couple. Next time you see us, we're gonna be doubled up on a sled going, Bram! Yeah!
Rip, 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 rip. Hi guys, welcome back. We're set up. We got Josh over there. We got two jaw jackers in with big, big minnows on them. We're looking for walleyes. We're set off on a, on kind of a little shelf, a little feeding shelf that drops off into deep water here. So hopefully these fish transition out of the deep water into the intermediate or shallow water. And we crack a couple, a couple walters when the sun gets a little lower. Sun is still pretty high. Like, look, look, I'm fishing in light little shirt here and sweatpants. It's been a crazy five days. That, the, the lake trout definitely hurt us. This is our first time actually targeting walleyes this entire time. You know, we've been fishing with jigging spoons, so you kind of catch everything, but most of the time we've been, you know, specifically fishing deep for lake trout. I want to end it with a big walleye. We upgraded our trout by like six, seven inches this morning. We could upgrade our walleye by eight inches, and that would be, I'd, I'd be happy with that. You know, I think we put up some decent fish. Not, no bangers, that's the only thing. So I'd like a big, big greasy walleye just to put an exclamation mark on, on our five days. It's been good. We caught some nice fish, some nice pike while lake fish, laker fishing. And I'm using the True Grit, the 38 medium the big walleye slugger the other option that would have been good here would have been the run and gun the 50 inch medium nice long rod for standing and fishing 10 pound braid 12 pound floral leader for the big mama walleyes and uh yeah josh and i are actually both using dinner bells medium 3 16th ounce i'm using the white glow he's using the insanity pepper the chartreuse one and um that's all i got we got two jumbo minnows on those jaw jackers so we'll see Oh, that was cold. Oh, that was cold. Oh, oh it's down my butt crack. Oh, baby. <laughs> Buy one, get one free. Well, we just got hit with a kiss of wind, which means the weather's changing. I see some clouds just about to eclipse the sun. You know, when these things do coincide, you kind of want to, it, it's nice to be on, you know, a confidence, a good spot where you know there's fish around. And right now we're on one of those spots. We're gonna get some weather, we're gonna get the sunset, and we are gonna end this thing with the biggest walleye ever captured on film. Oh, it's on! Yes! Oh, that's a fish, baby. Yeah. Oh, Joshua. Okay. Oh. oh, baby. Okay, oh, I just gotta tie this fish out because it's light line. Light line. You wanna spit those seeds out? All of them? Well. Oh. Look, it's off. No. It got off. No! Not even a head shake, just gone. Oh, that's so frustrating. The bait's still on. Oh, I'm sorry, dude. I didn't touch the line. I touched it, but not like anything that would nope. have bumped it off. That's fine. Okay, we need to set that back. Oh, that hurts. That hurts so bad, Yeah, I'll get that. Ah! That was a big walleye. That was the one. That hurts a lot. Prime time, anything could happen. You got him? Got him. How is he? Josh just hooked up. Those head shakes look all right. No, it's not that big. Oh. Oh, that's fat. Yeah, buddy. Super fat walleye, oh my god! I'll get you another minnow. <laughs> Perkiest walleye, unreal. So we're starting to get bites. I'm gonna let this guy go. Yep. Thanks, buddy. I wonder if the fish are in just a slower mood and that's why this is triggering them. There we go. Got Jacker. Oh, I want that one back. It was a big one, that was the one. On. Decent? Yep, nice. It was aggressive at least. Ooh, I like the water, it's moving Josh. Come on, baby. Game of inches, final hour. Let's go. Come on, always oh, moving water. Oh no. Oh no, keep it, keep it. Why is this happening? Okay, we gotta get another minnow on there. ASAP. Oh. Everything stings a little more in a competition. Oh, I hope we get another shot. That'd be so sad to end on that note. We got time, Josh. We got time. It's gonna happen. We got a half hour from now. This one might do.
Jaw jacker, jaw jacker, jaw jacker. That looks big. It's big. Watch that drag. Oh, it got off. What happened? Oh. Why is this happening? Let's go, let's go, let's go. We got half an hour. That was such a big one. I had a, such a nice mark on me when your jaw jacker went off. Okay, you're good. That one set the hook so good. Yep, too many opportunities. 19 minutes remaining. 19 minutes. On. Josh is on. Please. Oh, gee. That's what the last one was doing. Keep a little more attention on him near the hole. Oh, please. Oh, please. A little more attention on her. Crank that drag like a notch or two. Oh, boy. Oh, we need this. Okay, watch, watch, watch. Oh. Oh. Oh, please. I saw the leader. A little more attention. Oh. Get her head up. Get her head up. Come on. Come on. Come on. This is so frustrating. You're so close to lifting. I would say any second here you can probably. Come on. Here, I see, I see color. Oh, that's a big walleye. Oh! <laughs> Holy crap! Baby! Look. That thing is massive! At that walleye. Game of inches, 15 minutes left on I'm gonna get the, bump the insanity board. pepper. Oh. 29 and a half, yeah, just a pinch over a half. Okay, show me Josh. Let's hold him up once. That is such a heavy walleye. This is a hearty fish. All it right. feels so good to we hold We gotta it. put her back. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Yes. Oh, buddy. We did it. Oh my gosh. We did it. Uh, how many minutes left? I don't know where my phone is. Like, we're done. We have like 10 minutes yeah, left. Yeah, like minutes. 10 minutes left. Fourth try is the charm. Yeah, I lost so many fish that I couldn't keep one pinned. Oh, okay. We got we got some work to do, and I'm gonna go sleep for like 46 hours. We're, we're not done talking to you guys, but we gotta we gotta clean up rods. Like we're done. That, we like, gotta pack up and we gotta trek back, dude, to the car. What an ending. Good job, buddy. Oh man, what a roller coaster, oh. eh? I was getting it was getting in my head. That's perfect. That's absolutely perfect. Couldn't really get a better ending. <laughs>